Alright, so Winter's Veil vale has come yet again, and in Season of Discovery, we're going to talk about all the things that we can do. Now, of course, we can't do everything because the level cap is 25, but one of the first things we can do is find the new seasonal NPC inside of our main city. In the case of Stormwind, he's right outside the auction house. Talking to him, we can get this quest, which will say, Speak with Great Father Winter. He is in iron forge so i'm not sure exactly where it is for the horde most likely orgrimmar to thunder bluff or one of the other <clears throat> he also has a bunch of vendor things including two cooking recipes that are fairly cheap as well as some holiday wrapping paper spirits and the holiday spices which are required for cooking these two recipes now also inside of your main city you can find a px 238 winter wondervolt in the case of alliance in stormwind it's right near the flight master if you talk to the goblin next to it it'll say step on in and don't be shy if we go ahead and just step in you can see it transports us or literally transforms us into a little Christmassy or winter veily leper gnome so pretty cool on our way to iron forge to turn that quest in once you arrive at the main faction city you can find great father winter sitting by the tree now come real time christmas yuletide morning we're going to be able to see that these presents are unwrappable and we can actually loot the presents from them now these can contain anything in level 25 cap from recipes to snowballs little things such as wrapping paper but you used to be able to get little pets and fun things like that from them now i know pets are a thing in level cap 25 so i'm really excited to see what we get from the presents this year <clears throat> Regardless, we can now turn our quest into Great Father Winter, get our 39 silver, and you can see that he now has the treats for Great Father Winter quest, which rewards a pastures gift pack. This is bring three gingerbread cookies and an ice cold milk to Great Father Winter. Now, we did just purchase that recipe for the gingerbread cookie you'll see it requires a small egg and a holiday spices the small egg can be looted around the world or purchased extremely cheap from the auction house as well as the holiday spices are only four copper for a stack of five and you only need cooking level one to complete this we can also see right next to him there is yet another booty bay goblin who's going to offer us two quests the first one is the stolen winter veil treats where it says locate the pastures and investigate what has gone missing in the snowy regions of the alterac mountains alterac mountains level 25 cap that should be a ton of fun the next quest he offers is metzen the reindeer now this rewards five preserved holly which transforms your mount into something more festive i'm excited to try this in ashenvale we're gonna do that so stick around you'll also notice that the quest reward is about three gold and all you have to do is find mets and the reindeer use the notes provided for you as clues to where he's being held awesome let's go ahead and do that so here we found Metz and the Reindeer in Searing Gorge. He is right here on my mark. As you can tell, he's pretty well surrounded by, uh, by a lot. Now these are level 45 to level 47 Dark Iron mobs. You can definitely come in here with a raid group and maybe survive, but we're going to try some sneaky tactics. So we're just going to leave our body right here and wait a second. Alright, so this should be fairly simple as we're going to try and res directly on top of him, pop evasion, and then all you have to do is talk to him, and it should prompt you to use the pouch of reindeer dust. I don't remember if it's a cast time. I don't think so. So I think we can res, pop evasion, and just talk to him. Let's go ahead and try it. Three, two, one, pop evasion, talk to him. Yeah, okay, you died really fast, so we're going to need another plan for that. So next try, we are going to resurrect, pop, vanish, see if that little minuscule time where they reset aggro is going to let us grab it. So we're going to accept, pop, vanish, and then talk to him. And we got it completed, just like that, so it's extremely quick. Last but not least, we have the Stolen Winter Veil vale Treats. Now this is going to send us up into Alterac Valley. You can land at the South Shore Flight Point if you are Alliance, and then just head north up into the Alterac Mountains, and we're going to be wanting to go into the Ruins of Alterac through the entrance right here. 
The first step of this quest is going to send you to find the snowman. Just a little goblin disguised as a snowman hiding in Alterac Mountains. Go ahead and ignore any battles going on behind you, as we really just need to grab the quest from him. You can land in South Shore and then go north. Go left from the Alliance Brigadier General and go right in here, where the quest can be found. You'll receive about one gold for turning it in, and they will give you the follow-up where you need to locate and return the stolen treats. Now, here we can see the Abominable Greech. We found him, or Greench. We found him right here at 2950 coordinates, and he is surrounded by a bunch of level 35 yetis. Oh yeah, and uh, be careful, because this can definitely happen to you. Now, the Grinch fight itself is very straightforward. He's extremely hard to get aggro on because <clears throat> you're missing 90% of your things, so just watch your aggro and be ready to run. He goes down extremely quickly, and honestly, he doesn't hit that hard. Upon returning to your city where Great Father is, we can turn in your A Mean One and these Stolen Treats. For this, we're going to get 1 gold and 98 silver. We can also turn in the Metzen quest. Now, this right here, when we turn them in, will give us the Smoky Wood Pastures special gift, as well as another three gold, which is pretty cool. So let's go ahead and turn this in. We will get five preserved holly and another three gold from the Metzen quest. And going over to Great Father Winter, we can do the treats, turn that in. We'll get one gold and one gift. We turn this in, get another gift. Now let's see what's inside these gifts. Inside of the first one, we got a recipe for Elixir of Frost Power. Very, very cool. And in the second one, we got 10 Mage Royal. So the first one was definitely better giving us that. But throughout this chain, we got right around 9 gold. If you're inside the inn of a city, you may notice that there are winter revelers standing under the mistletoe in the inn. If you target one of them and slash kiss, you'll actually receive mistletoe in your bag. Just a fun little item that you can get. You can do this once an hour. If you enjoyed this video, I'm trying to be the first to make guides on everything throughout Season of Discovery, and I try to do it in a straightforward, no BS, no wasting your time type of way. So consider subscribing, and definitely drop a like on the video as it really helps.